welcome welcome you water signs uh, it's time for love baby girls and boys let's see what's coming out for you love i hope you guys are doing good and not <sighs> killing you people off okay all right relationships are just learning to love each other um i want to say thank you for returning my darlings it's good and hot we are having a hot summer well sometimes it's hot sometimes it's cold so i'm happy there's some deception in your relationships addiction okay some of you your partners could be drinking all right i see some deception that is going on i love you anyway um this is written for the Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpion. Let's see what is going on. If you want to see the extended of this reading, become a member on my channel, subscribe, and shares, and set on your notification button. There is some deceptiveness with friendships. Okay, so um, you're going to be finding out something about that because I see deceptiveness in friendships and addictions. Okay, let's see what is coming out. So I see some of you are going to see the truth about a relationship. Or a friendship um about your partner your husband so i see um you're going to be seeing the truth about someone you're in a relationship with i see you're not going to be worried anymore um it is as if your worries is going to be over i see you're going to be trying to protect yourself um from the person you're in a relationship with or a marriage i see some of you are no longer going to be working on whatever the marriage is i see um you are overcoming a situation with a leo um i see that whoever is in a relationship with a taurus Virgo, or capricorn you're seeing the truth about this person okay so however um that is happening and uh, transpiring so let's go in uh, my eyes are tired so if you're in a relationship with a young taurus Virgo, or capricorn person I see you're going to be seeing the, the truth about this person and who this person is. I see some of you are ending a relationship with a Leo, whoever this Leo is and whatever that has been transpiring. You're like, I don't need to deal with this person anymore. I'm letting go. So let's see, because I see some of you are going to be seeing some deceptive play with some friendship um, that you're having. Um, you could be seeing people. Okay. So, so you're seeing the truth about um this is a virgo so some of you are finding out and seeing the truth of a virgo whoever this virgo is and if whatever is transpiring i see you're going within and seeing the truth you could be married to this virgo uh living with this virgo um definitely that this virgo is only in it and all they want um is the house they're creating so much burdens for you so you could be married and you are thinking whether or not you should work on your marriage and that you know your partner has been creating some issue i see truths are going to be coming out about this virgo so some of you go within and some of you are going to be seen and putting the puzzle together with a virgo and you're going to let it go you're going to be like to do because you're finding out who this person is and why this person i choose to marry to you or connected to you However, this is happening and transpiring. I see you're seeing the truth. That is because of your materialistic wealth. Okay. Then I see an offer is going to be coming in. Um, an offer of love is going to be coming in or an offer of marriage. Or I see that a new offer could be coming in for you because your burdens is going to be over. So let's say that there was some quarrels and fight for a divorce and offer. I see you no longer worried about an Aries Leo or Sagittarius. I see so many secrets comes out about this person you're like and you make me look so bad and you have so many secrets i see an elin is coming in for um you water signs an elin um that has to do with an issue and a situation if you're in a relationship with a leo i see an elin is going to be coming in um because you're letting go you're letting go you're like jesus i never know all of this information is going to be coming out i see they're coming down um on a leah i see some of you are going to be receiving um a new um as if you're divorcing and you they offered you something you're going to be receiving something else whatever is transpiring with gemini's i see um some of you could find out that uh, 
um, a Gemini at work together to end your relationship I see a new story could be coming in if you want I see some of you wants a new start um, but you're not sure um, I see you're in your mind about should I stay should I leave um, that is coming up I see your end in communication with a Leo I see regrets regrets with a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn they're seeing the truth about this person and you also this person you are in love with the spicy cancer or scorpion person um, this is coming up as a, a cancer person um, some of you were in love with another cancer and uh, what has happened and transpired you find out the truth about this person and what this person has done so some of you were in a, um, in a relationship with a Libran okay whoever this Libran is and whatever is transpiring you were in a relationship with a Libran and you're finding out something about this Libran because there is some communication about this Libran and um, this Libran could have been connected with a um, a Leo or you could have been in a relationship with a Leo and you found out something that a Libran and a Leo has done and you want nothing to do with this these people anymore so um, be aware so when we look at marriage people who are married some of you Pisces are seeing the truth that um, you you're carrying a lot of burdens um, in your marriage a lot um, I see some of you are trying to protect yourself uh, protect yourself from a scorpion and protecting yourself from an Aquarian man whoever this Aquarian man or woman is you're trying to protect yourself from this person I see you have no win and you want no new start um, with a Leo because you finally see the truth about this Leo and the deceptiveness and that this Leo was only in a relationship with you for money whatever is happening to the Gemini's I see a lot of you are realizing that uh, a Gemini who has invaded your life you're seeing the truth about this person and there's a whole lot of secrets that is coming out about a Gemini some of you um, a Gemini wants um, to work with you I see um, some of you a Gemini wants to return in your life but I see you're not giving this person a chance because um, you're not sure if uh, um, it is going to be working out so you don't want to um, like um, start over and it doesn't work out Elin is coming in some of you who are in a relationship with a fire sign woman um, I see you're healing yourself from this relationship and you choose not to move forward with this person okay um, I see communication is coming in um, from a Leo and you're trying to block this person from you you have uh, I see this Leo want a second chance um, this Leo is going to be communicating to you guys that they want a second chance and you're going to say no uh, I see you Pisces are like no um, you don't know, let me let this go I don't want to whoever is in a relationship with a Libran you are going to be finding out that this Libran with another person block you from a friend or some something like that so be aware all right so we see some heartbreaks you people are seeing the truth about um, a Virgo and secrets about a Virgo and heartbreaks um, whatever the secret about a Virgo and um, secret about a cancer who you're married to it's coming out um, some of you are going to be seeing that uh, um, a scorpion a Aries or a Sagittarius has stabbed you in your back and I see they're coming back to you asking you for a second chance all right I see girls stalk because someone is sad a lot of news came out um, someone find out a whole lot about their relationship you are connecting with people and kind of you know talking this out it's good to talk whenever these things happen I some, see some of you are being watched however this is transpired could be on your telephone it could be there's a hat on your telephone whatever but I see that some of you Pisces are being watched be careful because it has to do with a Sagittarius is watching you I see the tower moment is coming down um, the tower moment is coming down because some of you decide you want to end a relationship with a fire sign person um, that's it 
I see some of you wanted to move forward, but um, it's as if it's not going to be happening um, because you're in your head. Should I move forward? Should I stay? Okay. Um, should I go with this Leo? Shouldn't I? Nope. Um, I see a tower moment is coming down a, a clock ticking moment. Whoever is in a relationship with a young Taurus, Virgo or Capricorn, a tower moment, this relationship is going to be, um, expired. Um, so if you're in a relationship with a Taurus, Virgo or Capricorn, a young person, this relationship is not, I see a recording. It's as if some of you were in a, a relationship with a Libran or a Libran have said something to you and you're going over and over and over and over in your mind about what this person has said, whatever this person has said, you're going over and over and over in your mind, the information, what this person has said, and you're like, hmm. And going over and over in your mind, you're going to be like, oh, really? And you're going to be finding out the truth about this Libran. Like you, you connect with, with this Libran. It could be your wife or so. And maybe she's upset and she says something and you're like, oh my God. So you are the one, you are the one who did that. So that sort of a, a situation is coming up. So let's me see. You're going to be finding out that a Sagittarian has stabbed you in your back. So Pisces, whoever you are, um, definitely you're going to be finding out that a Sagittarian has stabbed you in your back. I see truths are coming out that is going to break your heart. Um, and uh, whatever is transpiring, whatever this information is about, um, it's like you've been watched by an, an, an Aries. Some of you are going to be, uh, have been stalked by an Aries, so um, be aware of this because um, whoever this Aries is and whenever it, um, fire people stalk you, a whole lot of to tower moment. The, the only positive things is that um, there is a, like a whole lot of arguments, a whole lot of um, anguish, a whole lot of, um, you know, relationship is on the, um, the edge and, and, and the whole lot is going on. And the only thing is that I see some of you have some regrets, regrets um, with a relationship. I see really your relationship is like um, the clock is sticking on your relationship. That means it's going to be ending. So mm -mm -mm. Um, I see um, um, the Taurus and the Virgos. Um, yeah. Okay. So um, some of you are dealing with a Pisces. Um, and whatever is transpiring, I see you're trying to heal this relationship and work on this relationship. So that is good. So whoever is in a relationship with a Pisces, I see this person is very helpful. And they are holding down the fleet for you. And they're going to be healing you, okay? So uh, they're going to help you to heal a heartbreak and whatever is transpiring. Um, some of you are in a relationship with a Capricorn. You're going to be moving in with a Capricorn, buying a house with a Capricorn, and you are going to be happy. Again, I see some of you are, um, dealing with a situation where, um, you realize that an Aries, um, and a Capricorn has created some issues for you that they have stabbed you in your back. Secrets is coming out so um this is about um a third party this is about um three people who were maybe you were one of these people um so it is um mars um mars the moon and pluto so we're dealing with um secrets about a, um a cancer um, a Aries and a Scorpio. Secrets is coming out about a Cancer, a Aries and a Scorpion. So if you're in relationship with these people, a lot, a lot of secrets is going to come out about these people. Now the truth is going to be shed um, on um, a Capricorn and a um, Libran. You're going to be finding out something about a Capricorn and a Libran. Okay. So um, whatever is transpiring, um, you're going to be finding out, um, if you're in a relationship with a Capricorn or a Libran with a Capricorn, you're going to be eating your heartbreak. Some of you could realize that a Capricorn has stabbed you in your back. 
um, um, some of you are divorcing and uh, a fire sign person, okay? So, yes, um, some of you are divorcing an Aries, okay? You definitely decide, I've had enough with this person. And Elin, there was, um, there was definitely, definitely, um, a third party and the Elin is coming in. So some of you, the third party could have been a Sagittarian. Okay. The third party, whoever, um, had a third party could be, um, a Sagittarian, but this person is being removed out of your life. Okay. I see a total moment coming down for a Sagittarian and it, you are no longer going to be worried. I see an Aquarian is offering some of you cancer something, but, um, do not go with this Aquarian because this Aquarian is going to set you up. Okay. Um, stab in the back and the camera. So whatever is transpiring and an Aquarian, um, offer you, um, to return in a relationship or, um, they want to a new start. No, they're going to set you up. That's why they want it. Jupiter and, um, Jupiter and Mars. So some of you, you're going to be finding out some information about a Sagittarian and a Taurus. Now, whatever the information is, is that you're going to be finding out that a Sagittarian, um, have you on camera and is using it against you. They have whatever picture on camera and is using it against you. Some of you, a Sagittarian is focused on you. Um, so this person could be a, um, a stalker okay so be aware then we see you you have no worries about your marriage anymore you can just or like you know however if it ends it ends if it uh, survives um, the shutdown then it's good um, you can just or like I'm not really worried about this I can't um, I see an Aquarian and a Libra once a new start some of you um, an Aquarian or a Libra is going to be asking you for a new start. However, this is happening. But is this what you want? I see conflicts. Conflicts with a... Um, conflicts with a... a, a um, about a, a, a Sagittarius. Whatever is transpiring. Conflicts with a Sagittarius. Whatever is trans coming up. I see some recorded information um you some of you if you're in a relationship with a sagittarian you're going to be recording um a conversation that a sagittarian is having with an aquarian however this is a uh, transpiring it could be that some of you um are, your partner sent um um like an investigation an investigator on you um they're checking you out okay now I see you're going to overcome a situation with a Leo. So cancers, whoever or dealing with a Leo or however, if you water sign dealing with a Leo, you're going to be um, getting out of this relationship because you realize that this Leo has set you up. Some of you are dealing with an Aquarian. I see again, clock is ticking. Some of you end the relationship with an Aquarian and they're coming back. But they're coming back because they want to record you. So if you end a relationship with an Aquarian and all of a sudden this person pop up, they want to record you. They're going to be using the information against you. Hmm. Some people are just very sick. Um, all right. So um, I see some of you um um have some regrets. Um with a marriage, with a um um you ver with a Virgo, so some of you have some regrets with a marriage with a Virgo. However, this is happening and transpiring. Oh my God, um, um, what a sign! You're really, it's as if this is like this is like a crazy time with real relationship. So I see that some of you need to protect yourself. Some of you really need to protect yourself from an Aquarian. Whoever this Aquarian is, this Aquarian is trying to reconnect with you because they want to set you up. So we have the camera here. An Aquarian is going to be offering you like they want to talk to you or and they're setting up a camera and they're recording your session. Whatever is transpiring, they're going to be recording your session and bring it back to your wife to say that you are cheating yep 
so you gotta be aware and um, whoever have a weakness for an Aquarian let go of that weakness because this Aquarian is going to be the debt of you okay I'm warning you guys so they are setting you up because they they want to they they you know and whoever is married you're going to be finding that your partner is cheating okay and i see they're going to be coming out and the, the information and it's as if some of you were in a relationship with an aquarian you ended the relationship and they can't deal with it and they're going to set you up because it's as if they want to have the information in order to give to your wife because it's as if they're thinking if uh, I can't have you I'm, I'm I'm creating issues in your marriage and that's kind of sick um, it is a sick situation but um, it, it's going to affect um, um, you cancers um, that an Aquarian or it could be any one of you water sign Pisces cancer scorpion an Aquarian is coming back in your life in order to set you up they want to record your in your information they are going to be asking you like about your marriage or whatsoever and I see that some of you have some affection it can be an Aquarius it can be a Gemini it can be a Libran but whoever this person is it's as if you had an affair with this person and this person life is miserable so this person is going to set you up because they're kind of going to record your information and use it against you either to send it to your wife either to send it to your husband but they're going to be trying to use this information against you so I'm warning you guys because this thing is really getting out of hand it's sticking out of hand there is a time bomb some of you are having um, or in a relationship with a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn that is a time bomb okay this is the first time I'm seeing this is really a time bomb. I see some deceptiveness that is going on um, around you cancers, whatever is transpiring in relationships. If you're going to divorce, they're going to. And I see someone wants to ruin your marriage. Okay, so be aware of this. Then we have the Aquarians again here. Um, yes, and it has to do with um the cancers cancers whatever is happening and aquarius is about to ruin your life i see I, um there was some ending a divorce um between you or a, 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 the ending of a relationship between you and an aquarian and they're going to be um in order because you have ended this um relationship it could be a side piece chick it could be someone that you are seeing um you decide to cut off this person this person is going to be calling you back and Putting a little butter on your lips, getting you in, roping you in, and yeah. Don't do it. Anyone who you end a relationship with, end it. Because this person is going to want to come back and ruin your life. Okay, so be aware of that. I love you guys. And there is just so much issues and situations. Some communication is coming in. Some of you are going to do a divorce as, as a Sagittarian or an uh, Aries. And they're going to be creating a lot of issues. They're going to be putting a private detector on you and that sort of a thing. Whoever is in a threesome relationship or having threesomes, you're going to be caught. Okay, so um, be aware of this sort of a situation. Um, there's sadness. There's sadness that is coming up that some of you um, who was in a relationship, uh, there is deceptiveness uh, and it has to do with uh, um, cheating is going on. Someone is being cheated on. You who are married, you're being cheated on. You got to protect yourself, okay? And there is just, I, I just need to find out what is going on with this. Um, because there is, um, some of you are dealing with an Aquarian, mm -mm -mm. It's as if this Aquarian is going to be failing, falling, and they want to bring you down with them, okay? So, let's see, who are you, what are you? Tower moment. Yeah, it's an Aquarian. Some of you are ending a relationship with an Aquarian, whoa. And, uh, but you're going to be you're going to be winning this okay you're ending a relationship with an aquarian the aquarian is not very happy um because they're not going to be getting any more money 
Okay, so um, it was all about the money. You were with this person. It was all about the money. And you're ending this relationship with this person. And they don't... And you're leaving and moving forward, but they're going to be trying to get back at you. So be aware. Um, let's see what else is coming up for you guys. Honesty is the best policy. Relationships cannot base on false. Um, you have to be honest to each other. And if um some people said, Yeah, but sometimes I'm honest and my wife or my partner doesn't believe me honesty is the best policy okay it is better that you honest to them hey uh, i'm not feeling it anymore um you know we need to let this go then they find out i think that that is the most traumatic thing for someone so whatever is transpiring um if you cheated you gotta be honest hey listen um i got a weakness i cheated tell before it comes out it's better um, when you tell, when that person call, you can said, Hey, yeah, it was a one time hit. It was just a hit. It was not that good. Hey, yes, I did it. But you are honest enough to say that. Yes, you did it. I see you're going to be overcoming whatever tribulations comes up in your relationship, but honesty is the only thing that is going to help you. I love you guys. Please remember to share, 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 and I will speak to you next month. Bye.